Today I'm going to show you how you can turn your mobile device, like your iPad or your phone, into a second display for your computer. Or a third display or a fourth display comes in handy, especially when you're gaming. Stay tuned! Hi guys, LaserBullet here and welcome to another episode. Space Desk is a neat little program that allows you to turn your tablet or iPad into an extended desktop for your computer. I like using it for my flight simulator setup for displaying GPS and avionics panels. You can grab it for free in the link down below. So to get this to work, you're going to need two things. First, you need to download and install the Space Desk driver onto your PC. This is a little extension that just runs in the background of your computer. And then on your tablet or mobile device, go to the App Store and grab the Space Desk Display app. And also make sure that you're logged into your router using your administrative password and not the guest network password. Now simply launch the app on your tablet and it should automatically discover the main PC. If for some reason the PC you're using doesn't show up on the list, you can just use the handy little info button at the bottom of the screen. That'll help you diagnose any problems. Now simply select the desired server off of your list of detected machines and bingo! You have an additional monitor on your PC. You can verify this by clicking on the display settings. Ordinarily I run a two monitor setup. As you can see here I now have three. And you can drag these around and set them up in any configuration you'd like. I like having mine off to the left side, so now every time I drag something off the left side of my main monitor, it ends up on my tablet. Now let's put this extra display to use since the Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. Once you've got the simulator all fired up and you're sitting in the cockpit of your aircraft, you can pop out some of these displays just by holding down the right ALT key. and now you can simply drag and drop them onto your tablet. Unfortunately, this doesn't work for things like gauges, only display panels. Now, this setup comes in particularly handy when you're on a really long flight, and that happens quite a bit in Flight Simulator. Now you can just grab your tablet and take it with you if you need to cook some dinner or maybe watch a show or something. Now you can keep an eye on your instruments from anywhere in your house. So anyway guys, I had a lot of fun today. Hopefully this was informative. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye now.